Today is World No Tobacco Day. It is a day on which we acknowledge the significant morbidity and mortality caused by tobacco across the world uh, over the years. It is a day on which we pledge to help our patients and the community give up tobacco comfortably. Recently, there have been news in media and uh, in newspapers and on television and on WhatsApp forwards uh, that smoking cigarettes might actually protect you from corona infection. While these were initial observational studies, what we know for a fact now is that when an individual who smokes develops a corona infection, the infection tends to be more severe. Individuals who suffer from chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, a disease caused by cigarette smoking, tend to have poorer outcomes if they do get infected with the coronavirus. So the next time someone tells you that continuing to smoke might actually protect you from the virus or that cigarette smoking is good for your health, remember that there is an entire lobby which stands to benefit from such misinformation. We know from years of research and clinical observations that tobacco consumption in any form is hazardous to your health. So let us take a pledge on this World No Tobacco Day to give up tobacco and know for a fact that there are medicines and support that is available to individuals who want to give up tobacco comfortably.